welcome to mine and Chris's YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe and turn your notification bell on. This video is talking about how much sleep am I getting? <laughs> well, um, how much sleep you're not getting really. Yeah, that should be it. <laughs> yeah. That's more like the, the right way to ask it. I'm not getting much sleep at all to be honest. I'm not I'm lucky if I get three hours. <laughs> if that be honest because of the insomnia and like it's getting draining now isn't it yeah it's getting you seem to be more withdrawn and distant a little bit not too much i mean but you seem more withdrawn and i mean yet you're calm and sedate but you're you're very i, I guess tired and very withdrawn. I'm tired of being tired. Yeah, but you're also withdrawn too, and that's totally understandable, you know. Yeah, I mean, doing videos and that, I've been saying I'm going to do videos for the last, what, Week. three or four days, and haven't done it. No, but haven't today I, you've had a kick up the backside. And But we needed to do them. Mm. But not sleeping, it's just... <clears throat> There's only so much a person can take and then I'll crash for like a day mm. and then I don't sleep again for a couple of months and then I'll crash. Yeah. And the psychiatrist that isn't doing anything about it. So when I see the CPN, I'll ask her to chase it up for me and see if she can do anything about it. Mm. <laughs> Might as well use the resources I've been given. Yeah. <laughs> Because yeah. I, I mean, I had insomnia as well, and I've got it on my diagnosis sheet. Yeah. You need it on yours. Diagnosis for me. Yeah. I mean, I've struggled with sleep before, but not like, not like this. In the past, I struggled with sleep here and there, like a couple of days here and there, not sleeping. That was, that's minor. But now, this is the. The longest it's ever been. Yeah, but do you know why? No. No reason at all. No. None. No. I ain't got nothing weighing on my mind or anything like sure. pondering or anything like that. Nothing like that. Nothing at all. Nothing. So it's just insomnia. It's just I can't sleep. My body's decided not to let me sleep for whatever reason. I don't know. So that's what we've got to try and do. Do you think it's a psychiatric condition itself that's causing it? I don't know what you mean. Well, no, I just mean like um, like a psychiatric condition that's making it like that. Possibly it could be, I don't know. Well, no, I mean, for example, there must be some kind of reason each night that you can't go to sleep and there must be a different reason every day because you when you get your head down you fight your sleep you fight it I've you actually, fall asleep. yeah i know you've always fought your sleep but sometimes you just fall asleep yeah you don't just fall asleep you actually have your eyes physically open because you don't want to go to sleep and i think to myself why don't you just close your eyes and just try to get rid of what happens during the day. Yeah, but I don't, nothing that doesn't weigh on my mind from what happens in the day or anything yeah, like but, that. Yeah, so but you... I, I find trying to go to sleep, not being able to sleep. Mm, but you see, doing it that way... Keeps fight, me awake. Yeah, keeps you awake because you're fighting it and you're getting annoyed because you're fighting it not going to sleep. Because I want to go to sleep, yeah. but I can't go to sleep. Yeah, because, you, because you, yeah, you're fighting your sleep, this is the thing. And it, it, it's like a, a, a rolling thing. Yeah. And it keeps going on. And the more it rolls, the bigger it gets. Yeah. So, yeah. You get what I mean? Mm. Like, I'm constantly fighting with myself. I've always yeah, been a fighter asleep ever since I was little. Yeah, I know. But do you think it's something that goes back for back in time from then, or...? Probably. Yeah, but... Possibly. Mm, why, though? Because I've always been a fighter. 
Well, not, I mean, you said I've had a few nightmares here and there. Well, so. not many. I mean, it's just like grunting and things like that, but it, that means it doesn't mean anything at all because it is totally inaudible. Yeah. But, you know, you could be dreaming about having a pot of gold on, behind the sofa or you could be dreaming about some nightmare. <laughs> Probably a nightmare or and you don't remember, but... You know, the thing is, you can grunt while you're awake, for goodness sake, if you know what I mean. Mm. Because you'd be half asleep and you go, oh, like that, and I'm thinking to myself, you're fast asleep. So the thing that I like to hear you, 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 your noise that you make at night is snoring. If you're snoring a little bit, then at least I know that you're asleep. Well, you woke up at what one o'clock this morning. Yeah, but that's and because I. Yeah, but that's because I'm, I I I suffer insomnia as well. But I went back to sleep again. Yeah. In this chair, but now I had a long time not sleeping, so I know how you feel, and it does make you feel like not doing stuff, um, letting things. You know, it just gives you, it doesn't give you the energy, you have no energy to do nothing. Mm. And it's a shame because you just have to keep carrying on. And because you have so much on your mind to look after me because I'm not capable of doing everything that I can do, sometimes I think to myself, that plays on your mind and that's what makes you not sleep. Mm. Doesn't yeah. bother me. Doesn't bother me. We're a team. We do things together. Oh, I, I know, I, I know, and we, we, we are a team, and we do things regardless. Yeah. It doesn't matter, no matter what happens. But you know, I don't class myself as a burden, and you don't shouldn't class yourself as a burden if you want to sleep and that's up on on there or or anywhere else. It doesn't matter. I don't bothered. But you need sleep, and take whatever opportunity you can to sleep, because. I will admit that doctor that you saw down there that didn't have no idea about prescribing medication, none at all. So no. I'll go down there with you to see the doctor, trust me. And I'll explain to him because I think I know more about drugs than anything. So, yeah, the thing is that they need to sort you out. And if they don't, I'm going to go nuts on them because they need to do that. They need to do something because it's not right that they're just leaving me until next year. Well, no, it, no it's not right because it's disgusting. Right. It's I appalling. know next year's not far away, but like, I've not seen anyone. I've seen one psychiatrist this year. About that, about that, yeah. I don't class the one on the, the internet, the one that I spoke. <laughs> well, no, you couldn't see him. No. <laughs> I could see him, but he couldn't see me. Well, <laughs> you could see him so low to the camera. Sorry. You could just see him at the top I don't of his cap. Anything, cause no, I mean that you haven't seen a, a decent one. No. But hopefully, you know, you can get something from this CPM. Oh, we'll see. We'll find out in that mm. in a couple of days. But yeah, try and get asleep as much as you can. If you're struggling, keep fighting it. Keep fighting like you have to. I wouldn't say that. What? I know you, you would say fight it, but fighting sleep. No, you know, you keep fighting to get the right oh, yeah, keep, and the medication. Yeah, 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 that, That's what yes. I mean. Yeah. Don't I'm fight off, the sleep. I, no, don't fight your sleep, no, whatever you do. Fight to get the right medication and the right help mm. and treatment that you need yeah. to help you get to sleep. But let me just yeah. also say this before I go that medication i.e. sleeping tablets, the Zoplicums and the uh, other drugs that they give her, um, oh, are not that fair enough, they're fine short term, but long term they are so addictive. I would terrible. not recommend that to anybody. No. Not if you've got an addictive personality or something like that, no way. If, if you think you can come off a drug straight away, Maybe, but I don't know. I don't know. I think I'll be all right now, but I do have an addictive personality, mm. so I have to be quite careful. But yeah, just keep fighting for what you need at the end of the day. Yeah. So 
that's all I can really say on the now, I think. So, on that note, I'd say bye for now.